hello everyone and welcome to my youtube channel and in this video today we will see what to do if you cannot see cortana in your windows 10 if you will find this video helpful then please like and share this video Now if you want to know whether Cortana is available in your windows or not, what you do is you click on this, you will see this round icon here which is for the Cortana and if you click on this round, uh, round icon here, uh, you will see this, uh, this message here, what would you like me to do, that means Cortana is installed in your system. But in, in case if you don't see Cortana available in your system, then let us see what to do. Now the first thing is to make sure that uh, the administrator has not disabled Cortana in your Windows system. Now, if you are only the user of uh, of your computer, then you will know whether you have disabled Cortana or not. So, let us see how to bring the Cortana if it's not uh, available in your system. Uh, for that, you need to make sure that you have installed English language uh, as the language for your Windows. For that one. What to do is how can you check that one is you'll go to the settings click here start go to this settings here go to this time and language here click on reason and language and make sure that you have installed english united states if you have installed any other language maybe english india or english canada something like that click on it then click on option here and let uh, let windows search if there is any update for this uh, language now there are no any uh, updates right now if you find any updates here you need to install it now once you do that one then again click on settings under speech click on settings here and make sure that the language selected here is English United States a Cortana doesn't understand any other language beside English so this is how you can uh, bring the Cortana back if it's not available in your system make sure that it's not disabled uh, it's not disabled by the administrator Thank you for watching this video and if you found this video helpful then please subscribe to my youtube channel for more tips and tricks.